Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to episode number 21, I do believe, of Football Manager. And today we have Telford and Fylde in two games away from home and two games which will probably be quite difficult, I would expect. Um, I'm just having a look through um, fixtures. The under-18s are the only team with a decent record. <laughs> and our under-23s have lost 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 games on the trot. And we have not got a win in 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 games. So hopefully we can turn that around here. First, um, against Telford United. Because we are, I think we're just one position away from the relegation zone, which is not good news at all. Um, I'm just going to have a look. I'm really getting a few reports in which is good news but um we'll hopefully come back next for the Telford United game where hopefully we'll be able to come away with a victory all right so we're heading into the game and we are just two points off the drop Telford are um 12 points above us in 10th place why is Stike trying to play defensive midfield? I have no idea. Let's toss Green in there. Well, actually, Deeney normally plays CDM. He will go in there. He's only got 45 minutes in him, but um, yeah, we'll, we'll start him. That means we'll have to put Burns on the bench over Jack Lane. Um... But I think that'll do... No, we have to replace Briscoe. And we'll do that with kind of Taylor. And then Reese Stike will have to come back on. Oh, we'll put Jack Lane. No, we'll put Reese Stike on the bench. But, um... We just fix up all of these. We're going to have a look at our tactics. We start... We're going to start on defensive. Um... And we'll look and pump the ball up into the box. Oh, jo look at Jones has got terrible. Is that because I play him ninety minutes in the game? Um, oh, oh he's, he's not. No, he's not looking very good. We'll toss Jack Lane in there, who's looking quite comfortable, and Luke Jones will get himself a rest. But um, we'll head into this game. Hopefully, this team can come away with at least a point. Um, but I'm not, I'm not um, too confident, really. Um, what should we say? We go passionate. Um, get out there and show the world you've got what it takes. Wassy has gained some confidence. Um, but nothing really is looking good for us at the moment. Hopefully we can prove us wrong, well, prove me wrong, by getting a result out here today. But I'm not too confident of it. Here is Fox. Oh, it's got through to Connor Taylor. He'll cross. Oh, it's got all the way across, but Cowan is there to get it away. And we get the first opportunity, which is not a bad sign. And it'll continue to this throw-in, and here is Boutroid, he goes to Shomoton, but he loses the ball. And that's not a good sign, but this will be intercepted by Lane, and Lane finds Fox. Fox looking for Connor Taylor here. Back to Deeney, now Green. Back to Fox. Now Green again. Inside to Fox, can we work something here? Deeney, now Fox again. He's got um, Green there and he uses him. Back to Deeney now. Into Fox. Fox to Shomotan. We get past his man finding Jowers to Green. But his shot is straight at Wildig. Now Wildig's sharpness isn't very good. So I think we're going to look, we'll go try shoot on sight. See if we can 
get find a few pop shots and beat him when he's not really concentrating very well. But now we have a free kick and Belshaw hits it long and Connor Taylor doesn't win the header but here is Green finding Jowers. Jowers' shot is blocked and it deflects back to Williams who goes to McCarthy. McCarthy inside to Williams. Take that. Oh, he doesn't. But here's Kissock. Can we please win the ball? Hodge. Take that. Yes, Boutroid. Go, Jowers. Run. And he's going to get there first. But can he find someone? No. He's tackled. Win that. you got to win that. Oh, he's not won that. That's not good enough. Oh, but thankfully McCarthy's shot is very poor. And we'll get away with it there. Still nil-nil, but I would take a point definitely from this game. Here they come again. It's Hughes. Back to Hodge. Coming down the wing. Cross. That's not a very good clearance. Kissock, that's wide. Goodness me. Can't wait till Luke Jones is at back at full fitness because Watkins, Clark and Jack Lane don't really know how to play centre defence and that is shot is blocked by the wall. But Cowan will be first to the ball. Can he will win it back? No, we can't. Averne finding Kissock. He's got a bit of space. He's tackled by Deeney, but it's a foul. Goodness sake. And they will, the highlight will continue to the free kick, which is not good news, but it's well over. And still nil-nil. And here we have um, the ball up in our attacking half. It's Connor Taylor inside is Fox. Fox's shot is blocked. It falls back to Taylor. Cross is blocked. Cross gets in again, but Havern gets it away this time. We just can't find Jow is in the box. That was three, like three crosses blocked in a row, I think it was. And now we've got another throw in down in that position again. Here's Connor Taylor on the ball. He finds Deeney! Deeney! Yes, there it is! A 1 0 lead for us. That is, I think, my first goal in charge of Tamworth. I am not sure, but I think so. And it wasn't the best goal, but I'll take it. Deeney firing it in. I think that the goalkeeper's sharpness might have affected that. He receives it on the edge of the box. He's closed down, he takes it on his left. The goalkeeper might have done better with that, but he's not able to, and we will definitely take this, but now watch them come and score from this free kick. Laid off to McCarthy, but that's wide, and we'll keep our lead for now. Come on, lads, let's go. We've got a free kick here just before half time. Lane look for, looking for Connor Taylor, who finds Green. Now it's Fox. Fox shoots, but that's probably a waste of an effort. I know I've said shoot on sight, but that's probably a little bit too far out to be shooting from, I'd think. And there is half time. We have the lead. Happy with your performance so far. Keep it up. The lads are looking very delighted here. Come on, let's see if we can keep it up. I think I'll... Keep Wossy on for a little bit longer. I might take him off about the 60th minute mark. I hope that doesn't affect much, but he's just been so much better than um, Ryan Burns. Is it Ryan Burns or the number 11? As just I say that, he's letting someone in, or is that Boutroid out there? But the cross is straight at Belshaw, and we'll take that for sure. Throw in for them here. It's Cowan. He finds Hodge. Back to Lawton, his cross, away by Lane. Only as far as Lawton, here is Rhea. Now Hodge, cross is blocked. Ball straight back to Cowan. Cowan back to Lawton. It's been good defence in this highlight so far. Rhea back to Lawton. Lawton's shot, and we force them into shooting from range, and it goes well over. Come on, lads, keep it up. Great stuff. All right, so we'll probably sub off Shomoton after this highlight because he's looking tired, apparently. But um, we'll, we'll see how this plays out first. Deeney to Green. Green back to Deeney, looking for Jowers. I think he might be offside, but he's brought the ball down. Will dig with the save, going out for a corner. Oh, Cowan manages to keep it in. And Cowan, oh, it's the end of the highlight, but yes. We will we'll now um, bring off Shomotun for Dyer.
Hopefully we can hold this lead. Come on, lads. Throw in for us. It's Boutroid looking for Jowers, who finds Fox. First time ball to Paul Green, who's got a bit of space, but the shot was quite poor. And that may well be the end of the highlight, uh, but they do have, they will go for the goal kick. Who's underneath that? Dyer is. Preston. Boutroid with the interception, and it finds Jowers. Jowers back to Deeney, now Fox. Fox to Green. Back to Burns. That's such a poor pass from Burns. It's that man Burns stuffing up again. I really hope Wassey is able to play much more. Um, in the next game, because he's been so much better than Burns. But here is Taylor, back to Green. Green's shot is quite poor, though. If we're going to be shooting from range, can we get a decent amount of power on it? That was comfortable for any keeper. Well, what's happening here? Um, don't, just don't send Dini off. Oh, it's just a yellow. Good. And we still have our lead, but it's a, fr it's a free kick, and that's all that was. Great news. And here, oh, good. Well in by Watkins Clark, and his clearance makes it what make it makes its way up to Jowers. Connor Taylor needs to be making that run. Jowers shoots, but Will Dig is comfortable catching that one. Connor Taylor should have been making that run in behind. That's just not good enough. But that is the end of the highlight as well. We're coming up to the end of the game. There's a highlight here for them. Hodge shoots. It's over the bar. Now, um, concentrate. Concentrate, lads. Concentrate for these last few minutes. It's a throw-in for them here. Dielna to Rhea. Back to Dielna. Upfield, that one should be Lanes and is. He'll look for Jowers. Jowers doesn't have anyone to head it down to, but Green will intercept that header. Clark looking out for Connor Taylor. Dielna wins the header, but Burns should get to that. He does and finds Deeney. Now Clark into Green. Green shoots, but Will Dig does well to keep that under his control. And it will be the end of the highlight as well. Come on, lads. But there's another one straight after Will Dig's free kick. Go on, you got to win that, Boutroid. He doesn't. Why? He doesn't win it back. Oh, no. Samuels. Cross. Oh, Belshaw! Great save. They almost turned it in. The youngsters have been pretty good in this game in defence, but they almost completely stuffed it up there. Dielna into the box. Belshaw! Again. Great stuff from our keeper. And he's kept us in the game there. Let's go, James. And he whacks it upfield. Go on, Jowers. Go on, Jowers. Oh, can't win in the air. Dielna. Is, is that not the end of the highlight, Hughes? That one should be away. Whoa, oh, Watkins Clark. Lane just left it behind. And then Watkins Clark comes across and takes it out. Cowan. Watkins Clark again in the way. What a performance he's having in the last few minutes here. Cowan looking for Samuels. Please be offside. It's not. The cross. Deeney well in. Joe Clark get it away. He heads it on. Dyer up for Jowers who gets it past the number two, but he's tackled. Now Rhea, Hughes, back to Cowan. Come on, lads. Dig deep. Samuels, well in by Boutroid, and that's the end of the highlight as well. But they've got one last chance. We're almost at the end of stoppage time. Monthe blocks by Jack Lane. What a performance the youngsters are having. They're having a few slight slip-ups, but other than that, they've been rock solid. Hodge with the corner. Belshaw should catch. He does. And will that be game? Will it? We'll just he'll probably when he kicks it. There it is! We've come away with a victory away against Telford. What a brilliant performance. Very nice victory. Well done. That is um a lot less than what I want would have wanted to say, and that's jumped us up a few spots. And it's got us five points clear of the relegation zone thanks to Worcester's loss. What a performance. That is really great stuff from the lads.
hopefully this is what turns it all around for us at Tamworth. Deeney gets man of the match for his goal. Quite an uneventful match. Two highlights, Ellis Deeney's goal and Ellis Deeney's yellow card. But I don't really care because we have three points. And my first victory as Tamworth manager. Great stuff. I am buzzing. But here we are heading in to the filed game. And they're sitting up at near the top of the table. Um, a victory for them would keep them inside the playoffs. But a loss could see them drop out. So they'll definitely be looking to try and win this. Um, Briscoe's recommended to... Um, how many minutes? 60 minutes, as is Wassie, so we'll have to keep Burns on the bench. I kind of want to play Jones, but his sharpness isn't very high, and Watkins, Clark, and Lane, despite how many little mistakes they made in that last game that almost led to the others scoring, they didn't score in the end, and that's why I'm going to stick with them, and we're going to stick to this formation and tactics, and hopefully... We can come away with a victory here against Fylde, but this is even less likely. If, T if Telford Town was, I mean, Telford United was unlikely to pick up a victory, then this is even more unlikely. Um, passionately say, um, we can say passionately, actually, um, I was looking for like, yeah, no way for this. Uh, Unfortunately, that's not done anything positive, except for Jordan Jowers, who's relaxed. But that's the only um, positive uh, thing that's happened, and they're already coming on the attack. I feel like um, Fylde might be um, quite a strong team. But Bootroyd has won it back well there, and he gets it out. Nice, nice. That's just what we need. But here we go. What's happening here? It's a free kick. Here is Bond. Coming forward. Yes, Green, he's made a good tackle. What can he do? Nice back heel to Connor Taylor. He's taking it wide. Oh, he takes it past his man nicely. Go on, Connor. Oh, he's been tackled, though, by Bradley. And over the top. Oh, no, Lane. Babos. Lane gets back. He gets beaten. Oh. Maybe I should have played Luke Jones. I tried to show him some show some faith in him after his good performance, but he's just stuffed up. Don't know what he was doing. First he misses the header. Then he gets back. He does well to get back, but then he just gets completely beaten. And then Babos with a good finish. Belshaw could do nothing about that and we are going to have to score to get anything from this game and let's try and do that here is green now fox can we get something straight from kickoff no that won't be taylor's surely kennedy brings it down plays it back to their keeper but his clearance is only as far as wassy and this highlight is continuing which makes me a little bit hopeful here is connor taylor he Gives it away. Now it's making me a little bit scared. Con I mean, Kennedy. Now Bond. Can we win it? No. He's completely beaten there. Babos. Back to Kennedy. To Bond. To Bradley. To Hoskins. Boutroid makes a good tackle. We get it upfield. Go on. Jowers is in. He's got some space. He's getting... Oh, it's a good hit. But Taylor makes a good save. And that's we just need one of those goals, one on the break, and we are right back in this game. Shomoton is going to put the corner in towards Dini. No, it's headed away. Jowers will be first of the ball. He's got Shomoton there. He almost runs out of play, but he recovers and passes it all the way back to Wassie. That's the end of the highlight. Here they come. Oh, no. Goodness me. I didn't mean to press that at all. Here is Holland. Out to Atkinson. Come on. What are you doing? Get back in defence. Oh, great block. Falls to Bond. And the shot is blocked again. And Shomoton will be first to the ball. And Shomoton takes it away from his man. And he switches it across field. 
towards Connor Taylor. And Connor Taylor's coming forward now. But we've got no support. And somehow, that's, somehow that was a highlight. But it will stay at 1-0 and hopefully they don't score this free kick and Belshaw is comfortable to make the save. And they don't score the free kick. And that was the end of that highlight. Corner for us here, it's Boutroid. He puts it in away by Bradley. Oh no, Babos is going to get to that first. Can we win it? Swan. That should be our ball. Dini back up field. Can Jowers win that header? Not sure if he did or not, but it finds Green. Here is Fox. Back to Deeney. Now Connor Taylor. Inside to Green. Can we work something here? Back to Wassey. Deeney. Fox. Shomotan. Well, it's not a very good pass, but Deeney does well with it. He finds Green. Now out to Wassey. Connor Taylor. Can we work something? He's trying to get past the number three. He's not doing a bad job. And he gets the cross in. Shomotun, can he win the header? He does. But it's just wide. If only he could have found, found Jordan Jowers with the header across goal or something. But it will, it will stay 1-0 behind. Can we keep it up, though? We're getting a few um, opportunities. But now Shomotun's picked up an injury. I'll let him carry on until half time. And there is half time. But we're going to have to take off Shomo time. We'll bring on Briscoe. And Wassi, Wassi can play another another um, 15 minutes. But um, what should we say? Uh, yeah, I think we will say you've been unlucky. All the lads are. Getting relaxed and motivated and gaining confidence, which is great news. I will head back out into this second half just like this. Um, hopefully we can pick up a goal. Did we? No, we scored in the first half last time. Oh God, it's already racing up to the 60-minute mark. We've got a free kick, but Fox will probably miss any does. Uh, we won't make. We won't bring off Wassi yet. We may well bring him off now. We'll wait until after this highlight. Coker finding Kennedy. Now Bradley. It's closed down, but he finds Bond. Now Bradley. Babos. Back to Coker. First time to Holland. Finds Bradley. Out to Atkinson. Cross, Webb, oh! Why are we not, why are we not paying attention to Atkinson? I mean, who, who is that? That's bloody Boutroid again. I think we need a better left back, because Boutroid never seems to look who's on his outer. Atkinson, with a heavy touch, he managed to get there back there first, and Webb just kicked it in, and we're 2-0 down. Never seems that never seems to work. But we're gonna to have to come out of defensive now. We'll have to go attacking, try and pick up a win. Uh, what's happening? They've got a free kick. Holland, Swan, Bond. Back to Swan. Come on, win it, oh, Bradley, Babos. It's Atkinson again. He's got acres of space again, but thankfully Bell Shaw is gonna be on the end of that cross. Come on, stop. Do something good. We can't even win that header. And Bond somehow beats three of our dudes in the air. But we'll have that. Oh, somehow he's got it back to Bond. It's ridiculous. Thankfully, Deeney makes a tackle. But then Hoskins gets it. He takes it around Boutroid, who again does poorly. Babos shanks the shot, but it somehow finds the back of the net. just turning disastrous again why does it always why does this always happen why do we have to play one of the top teams as soon as oh that's taken the deflection of course what's happening here i'm missing it oh we've got it we've got the ball let's go connor taylor he looks for stike over the top he'll get to the ball 
Come on, Reese. what can you do? You've got no one in the box. But he'll find Fox on the edge, who looks for Louis Briscoe, who goes back to Deeney. Deeney shoots, but he can't pull off another goal like he did in the last game. And we'll stay at 3-0 down. Can we pick up a consolation goal here at the end? Green, will he not... Well, he doesn't win the header, but it finds Deeney. Here is Green again. Connor Taylor. Back to Burns. Green. Fox. Stike. Taylor. Shots blocked. We'll take the corner. Come on, lads. Let's get a consolation goal. Good thing Worcester are losing, so we won't be dropping anywhere closer to the relegation zone on points. But the corner is cleared only as far as Fox. Can we do something from the resulting um, play? Just don't give it away is what I'm looking at. Come on. Where, where's the, where's his support? Yeah, oh, it finally finds Deeney, but by the end of that, it's the end of the highlight. But now Green finding Connor Taylor. One last chance for a consolation goal, maybe. He gets the cross in. Green is there! But Taylor for their team makes a really good save. That He was wrong-footed there and he still managed to dive and make a good save. I think we just got to accept they're a lot better of a team than us. But maybe we have another chance here to get a consolation goal. It's Ellis Deeney into the box. It's away by Atkinson as long as we don't concede here. Yes, well up Watkins Clark. But that's the end of the game. It's 3-0 lost to Fylde. Um... Uh, I think we'll say that. Oh, dear. Fix it up. Oh. Well, I've stuffed that up completely. We're now down a few places. We've dropped below New Neaton, who are our rivals. We've confused and demotivated the team just as I was getting them back up with that win. Shomo tons injured for one to two days, that's not much. But that's a really disappointing end to the episode. Um I don't think there's anything else to say really. Uh thank you for watching. I hope you did enjoy it. We it was a decent episode. I think if the games had come the other way round, like starting with a 3-0 loss and then ending with a 1-0 victory. It would have been a lot more positive because we would have ended on a high, but it came the other way around, so I don't really know. It's not as positive, but anyway, please do drop a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.